Good morning, my dear students, and welcome to Big Data Analytics class. And in today's session, we are going to learn about different execution modes of PIG. So let us see what are the different execution modes of PIG. So there are two modes are present to execute the PIG commands or PIG script. That is, local mode is one, and the second mode is called as map reduce mode, or it is also called as Hadoop mode. So these are the two modes and on these two modes only we will be executing our pick scripts. So let us see how the local mode works and how the Hadoop mode or MapReduce mode works. So let us see here. So local mode you can see here all scripts will be running on the single machines. They will be running on the single machines and they do not require any Hadoop MapReduce or HDFS. That means if you remember Hadoop can be executed on three modes that is called as a local mode, pseudo mode and fully cluster mode. So in single mode you will be not having any HDFS, you will be not having any demons, all those things. Similarly in PIG also the same thing happens, right? So in local mode, there will not be running any HDFS or MapReduce and it will be running in the single machine. And this will be useful for developing and testing pig logic. For example, uh, just I want to know how my pig script is working, how my pig logic is going to work. So rather than applying on the fully cluster mode, I can make use of local mode. And if you are using a small set of data, if you are using a small set of data, then local mode could be more faster than going through the MapReduce infrastructure. That means I have very small amount of data and for that I do not require uh, MapReduce infrastructure. So in such case, I can make use of uh, local mode for executing the pig scripts because my data set is very small. And local mode does not require the Hadoop. And when you run on local mode, the PIG program runs in the context of local Java virtual machine. So the most important point is whenever you run the PIG in local mode, it runs in the context of local Java virtual machine and data will be accessed via the local machine of the system that means the data will be accessed from the local machine rather than the accessing the data from the HDFS. So when you are running the pig in local mode, data will be accessed from the system or local machine. So in a glance or in a short and sweet manner, if you learn about local mode, so in local mode there will not be any uh, need of HDFS, there will not be any implementation of MapReduce. And in local mode, there will not be any usage of the job tracker, task tracker and all. And when you have small amount of data sets, rather than using the MapReduce infrastructure, you can make use of it because it gives the result in a more quicker and more faster manner. So let us see here how to execute. That means if you want to go into the local mode, what is the command you are going to give is, you are going to give the command as pig minus x local. When you give pig minus x local, it will go into the local mode and then when you go, when it goes into the local mode, it makes use of locally available virtual Java machine and it will not make use of HDFS data. It will be using the data present in the local machine and the output will be also coming more faster because the size of the data set will be very small. So in this manner, we will be entering into the local mode of the pig that is the command is pig minus local. So we will go to the next mode that is called the map reduce mode or it has another mode that is called as a Hadoop mode. So what is a map reduce mode or a Hadoop mode is in pig the map reduce mode need to access the Hadoop cluster that is nothing but if you are entering into the Hadoop mode or map reduce mode. So the data should be present in the HDFS and the pick command will be working on the data set which is present in the HDFS. Whereas in the local mode, the pick commands will not be connecting to the HDFS, the pick command will be connecting to the local machine for accessing the data. So in this fashion, the Hadoop cluster will be working in the pick when it executes the pick commands. So you have client, we have pick and we have Hadoop. So client 
is nothing but it will be making use of any Linux terminals either the grunt or pig scripts or embedded uh, pig Latin commands and whenever you write all these pig scripts or grunt commands it will go into the pig Latin compilers as in the previous sessions we have learned about the pig architecture and the pig architecture we have learned how the compilers are working how the parsers are working how the execution engines are working so all those things will be happening here after that so during the working time whenever the pig wants the data so it will be connecting to the hadoop mode and where it will be running where it will be running the local job runner as well as the hadoop cluster that is called as a hadoop mode and this is your local mode so now i am connected to the map reduce so i will be connecting to the hadoop mode and in the hadoop cluster whatever the data is there my pig commands will be making use of the data whatever they want to use by the pick commands. So in this fashion, the Hadoop mode will be working, right? So I repeat it once again for your better understanding. Just keep a one point in the mind that Hadoop mode is nothing but the pick is making use of the, the pick script or pick commands are making use of Hadoop cluster. So one, once it makes use of Hadoop cluster, it makes use of the data sets present in the HDFS. Whereas in the local mode, it does not connect the HDFS, it does not make use of the data present in the HDFS, it runs locally, purely locally it runs. So when I should use local uh, mode and when I should use Hadoop mode is whenever my large data sets are available and then I will be using the Hadoop mode and when my entire script is ready and when I can run on the Hadoop mode, then I will be going for the Hadoop mode. Whenever I want to test my scripting purpose, whether my script is working properly or not, rather than running on the Hadoop mode, you can run on the local mode. It will be good because the result will be coming very quicker. So both has its own advantages and both has its own purposes. So to get into the map reduce mode, so how to get into the map reduce mode is you are going to give the command as pig. So as you have seen that for local mode, you have to give as pig minus XL here. You have to give here minus X local here. If you want to enter into the local mode, if you want to enter into the local mode, you have to give as a pig minus X local. If you want to enter in the form of a map reduce mode that you no need to give minus X local, you can just simply give the command pig. So once you give the command as a pig, you will be entering into the Hadoop mode and once you enter into the Hadoop mode, you can access the large data sets which are present in the HDFS. So that is all about the today's session. We have seen about the different execution modes of PIC that is your local mode is one mode and another mode is called as Hadoop mode. So the basic difference between Hadoop mode and local mode we have seen and both has its own purposes. So whenever you want the testing of script should be happen on small data sets, prefer the local mode and whenever you want to uh, test on large data sets and then you prefer the Hadoop mode. Thank you so much for listening the class and we will be meeting in our next session. Thank you so much.